All right, hi, hello, and welcome to another Pixel Words video. Today we are gonna be talking about things I hate in Pixel Words. All right, without further ado, let's start. But before we do, here is a quick sponsoring video. This video is sponsored by Msipper's Discord server. Let me tell quick some things about this server. First of all, there is a couple of marketplaces to sell your items fast. And of course, couple of channels giveaways and earning methods. Link to this server is first link in description. The first thing on our list is the amount of updates the game gets. Although I understand the current situation in the Kukukori team and the fact that there are no workers to even do the job, it still pains me to see a game that has a great potential getting only 3 up to 4 updates per year. And even if they come out, they are quite disappointing to say the least. Most new updates bring little to no new items and if they do, those items are mostly recolors of old items. Which again, is just recycling your old ideas. Which again, doesn't bring anything new to the game. Now, let's talk about something that really pains me. And that is the fact there's no influencer program. Personally, I haven't seen any influencer in the game for the past few months. Besides that, it seems like that the developers of the game don't really care about the YouTube community. You can see that by looking at the community tab in the game. They rarely repost any new videos. And if they do, it's some kind of uh, Merry Christmas wishes, which, let's be real, no one cares about them. Alright, for the third point, it's gonna be something big. Something that's been tearing apart uh, Pixel Wars for past few years. And I'm talking obviously about the unstable economy. Every two months, there's being released a new duplication wave, which makes all true items worthless. While other normal items that are not even limited are skyrocketing because of the overflow of bytecoins. The fourth place are taking boring quests. It's not really a big deal, but I think they are quite repetitive and boring. Not only that, their prizes are very lame. Prizes such as 25 buy coins or 50 gems are not gonna attract anyone. Alright, we are halfway through, and so our next point is the fact that there are no end goals for the players to complete. Like here, show. You can always gather your bytecoins and collect them to buy something nice. But do you really want to do that? Let's for example say that you've been gathering your bytecoins to buy Tormentor Wings for 2 months and wow, you really did it. You have finally bought your dream wings. You spent 30 millions of bytecoins. You take a break for 1 month and come back to the game. And guess what? Your rings that were worth 30 millions are now worth 2 millions. You just wasted 2 months of your precious time for nothing. And there we go. The last point on our list is the thing that is very important for any healthy community. And that is, you might have already guessed it, it's communication. It's one of many things that our dev team is missing. There are many players that would be eager to help the developers in many ways, such as item designs or new ideas for the game. Alright, that would be all. I hope you enjoyed this video and remember to smash the like and hit subscribe button. Adios.